Hello everyone, welcome to Email Picks. I hope you're enjoying the nice weather. So you know, yesterday I joined a party at one of our client companies. And there I met a really interesting person. Her name was Teresa and she worked for a small IT company. So we were discussing our uh, jobs and we got all excited about ideas for collaboration between our businesses. And we exchanged business cards at the end, so basically we had a good time. Now, yesterday, after the party, I was a little tired, so I went straight home and I went straight to bed. I was going to write a thank you email to Teresa this morning, but she kindly wrote me an email last night. So here's the email I got. Hello, Kyota. It was a great pleasure meeting you at the party last night at DriveTech. As we discussed, I see room for collaboration in our businesses. Let's keep in touch and grab a cup of coffee sometime. Regards, Teresa. So Teresa was a very nice person when we met, and this email from her tells me again how nice she is. Now, when we were talking about uh, our businesses, uh, it was very clear for both of us that we will not be collaborating anytime soon. But it was also very clear that we should keep in touch for future business opportunities. So, Teresa wrote, let's keep in touch and grab a cup of coffee sometime, which means not soon. What she means is, let's have coffee when we find a good reason to talk again. So I'm going to write a reply with a similar nuance. The messages I want to communicate are number one, well, I had a good time talking with you at the party. And number two, I also want to meet again sometime. So here's what I'm gonna write. Hello, Teresa. It was a great pleasure for me to share an exciting evening with you the other day. I had a wonderful time discussing collaboration with your company. Thank you for the brilliant idea to have coffee together. We'll definitely keep in touch, work hard, and reward ourselves with a cup of coffee. Best, Kyota. Okay, so first I thanked her for the wonderful time I had. And then I told her that having coffee was a great idea by writing. Thank you for the brilliant idea to have coffee together. But I didn't ask her when we should do it. Instead, I focused more on keeping in touch. Well, I wrote, we'll definitely keep in touch, work hard, and reward ourselves with a cup of coffee. Which means, let's meet again when we finish our work and we want a nice relaxing break. Okay, so I'm going to send this to Teresa right now and feel thankful that I met another wonderful person. That's it for today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching, and if you liked what you saw, please check out my previous videos. That's right, and don't forget to give our videos some likes and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And check out some of our other videos like Justin's Bizmates for Beginners and my words and phrases. All right, so thank you for watching. Bye. Bye.